is there any part of you that feels my, my career and what I want to do has to take a back seat now? And, 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 your, and Rove's career can go on, it doesn't alter his that much. Do you sometimes feel, and I know, like I'm so happy for my partner to be able to do what he is doing, but there's still so much I want to do and in my mind I go, that has to go on hold, that has to go on hold. I absolutely believe that the reason why women aren't more, you know, aren't more represented in the world in the way that they absolutely ought to be mm. is because of the burden of child rearing. It's so, and, and what is the answer to it though, you know? Because you it's literally really can't work for that first, but you can't just go, okay, I'm going to go to work, I'm going to do that. And then if you do, you feel guilty. I don't have the answer. It's a real dilemma, absolutely. It is. And yeah, it, 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 it really is. And, and it takes a couple of years, I think, before you can actually fully invest yourself back into the, you know, your career or your creative life or whatever. Totally. Because if you think about it, unless you have a great support network of grandparents and all that around all the time, mm. when do you get the time totally. to do something else? Yeah. But it, I have a, an amazing support network, but I still don't feel like I do. I still don't feel like I can just go back and do exactly what I want to do. Yeah. Where my partner can go and do his job fine. You yeah. know what I mean? But it's yeah. like, I don't actually even feel like I have that choice to do that. No, and I think if, you know, I think it's, it's quite rare for the situation to be reversed where yeah. the woman goes back to work straight away and the, the man stays at home and rears the child. Yeah. That's very rare. And for many people, that's still an unthinkable dynamic. Yeah. But even I go, oh, that could be nice, but it wouldn't work in our family Well, either. yeah, like I had, um, I had, I was thinking about this at, you know, when she was about week five or whatever, thinking... Geez, in some, I don't know what it actually is here in Australia, but paid maternity leave, I think, is only four weeks, isn't it? Uh, no, pay, you, oh, pay, oh, so like from the government, it's 16 right. weeks. But if you're on contract, like when I had my first, I didn't get money for that time. Yeah. So it's all still so ridiculous. You, so I was sort of thinking, well, if, if a lot of people don't have the choice but to go back to work because they need the money, yeah. I was not in any state. No Mentally way. or emotionally or physically. No, I know. To, to go back to work. Yeah. It just, I couldn't do it. No. no and nor way. could I leave my little baby in the care of somebody else, even if it was my mum or, you know, it just still would feel so innately and biologically not right. Yeah, I know. So, because I, I do, I get annoyed about it. But then I go, there is no answer because I. I don't want to be the one out working full time. I want to be around my kids, but at the same yeah. time, I get annoyed because my career has to go on the back burner a bit. You know, it's yeah, like yeah. as a woman, you just have to kind of go, "All right, this is the way it is," and I'll make the most of it and do what works for you. You know.